beer could be light and not compromise on taste. To be enjoyed on nights that start out as afternoons. Miller Lite. Hold true. He's trained his entire life to save patients. But Thursday, nothing's prepared him. My dad is hard. For this one. An emotional new Chicago Med. Thursday on NBC. She's renewing her vows, but does her groom still love another woman? What if he really belongs with Gabby? Now, here comes... We're gonna start a new beginning. The Bride's Bombshell. I can't be your wife anymore. Days of Our Lives, weekdays on NBC. <laughs> Just reminiscing with Maxie over here. Welcome back to Dancing with the Stars. Before the break, we saw Alan and Heather renew your vows, yes. cha-cha style. Yes. Uh, how was that, by the way, to have your real man up there and kind of have this moment here? I was all on television. Really? I was like about to start crying, and then I I looked at my mom. I was like, No, I gotta keep it together. I gotta do the stands, or else I'm just gonna like forget all of it. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Yeah, that's great. And then Alan took you away and yeah. ripped off the skirt and. Performed a cha-cha. Yes. Let's, see what the, let's see what the judges thought. Carrie Ann Inaba. Eight. Len Goodman. Nine. Julianne Huff. Nine. Bruno Tonioli. Nine. Thirty-five out of forty for Heather and Alan. That's the highest score of the night, guys. Highest score of the night. And of course, Maxie's here. Couple weeks now from surgery, been two weeks ish. Working on it, working, working on it. it. Working but, on but it. This is amazing. Yes. And I, I just want to say, I think Alan has proven his case more than enough to uh, for pro maybe next year. I, I didn't know you were producing I'm the show, saying, but no. I guess we have a new producer and it's Maxo. <laughs> Tom? Right, thanks, Aaron. Two time World Series champion David Ross chose one of those championship years as his most memorable. I'm from Boston, but he didn't go my way. You can probably guess which one when you see him train with Lindsay for a Viennese waltz dedicated to his family, his teammates, and his fans in Chicago. This week, it's all about your most memorable year 2016. Obviously, Cubs won the World Series, my last year playing baseball ever, which is, I mean, that makes my heart race, right? Before the season, I knew I was retiring, but I didn't know about how this year was going to play out. It was just about family, and it was my time. It turned out to be the most epic year I could ever imagine. I caught a no-hitter and hit my 100th career home run right over that, that sign over there. Like, literally everything perfect happened on your last game. The end of my career was a fairy tale ending, no doubt. Getting carried off the field game seven after hitting home run and winning the World Series for a team that hadn't won in over 100 years, that wasn't my wildest dreams. Chicago! I loved celebrating my teammates, but the first thing I was thinking about was my family. I want to thank my family, my, my wife, Hyla, my kids, Landry Cole, Harper, my mom and dad, and this group right behind me. Thank you, guys. When you want to be a good dad, you need to be there. That's the hardest part about baseball is just, you just always can't be there. Yeah. Yay, Harper! Dunk City! I've gotten to live my dream, and my job now is to be a dad and be there for my kids so they can live their dream. Way to go, bro. I love you. Nice job. One, two, three. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> What's up, on, dude? This week's dance is the Viennese Waltz to Forever Young. The song Forever Young for me is a big part of my 2016, my walk-up song. The lessons he's taught me have been just incredible. Being a good person on the field, off the field, a good parent. David has to rank number one as the best teammate I've ever played with. I feel like he's my dad slash my brother. I'll miss him every day. I love having you here. <laughs> I love you. I gave all that I could to, to the 2016 Cubs, and I love all my teammates, but my kids need me more and more every day. I can just feel it. Hey! I got nothing but the rest of, of their lives and my life to, to be with them. It's the most important job I can possibly have. Go, 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 go! <laughs> Let's dance in style, let's dance for a while Heaven can wait, we're only watching
watching the skies Hoping for the best but expecting the worst Are you gonna drop a bomb or not? dance floor and obviously seeing the packages are sometimes harder to, to watch before you dance right but it was so beautiful your spirit your energy is always infectious it's glorious it was a little squatty and a little skippity sometimes could have been a little smoother but you know I'm I love this team ah! <laughs> by the way squatty and skippity is available on the Disney oh, channel yes. <laughs> Yeah. Listen, but David, I have to say, you still have the vitality of a spring chicken and the <laughs> impetus of a teenager on a hot date. And with that hot girls, I'm telling you, I do understand. <laughs> I do understand. You were both gorgeous, wonderfully dynamic. Yes, she's right. You, you cannot jump on the Venice walls. It has to float. But beautiful routine, but you have to correct that. Yeah? All right. Good enough, Carrie Ann. As usual, you are very uplifting. There's something about you. You're the every man's man, and you just like make, I think, everybody feel like they can dance, and they can dance with heart the way you do, which is really nice. I'm going to say, though, you were skipping and hopping, and it, it lost a little control. I was like, he's running for home! I'm like, it's easy! <laughs> but I love the enthusiasm, and I think everybody else did, too. It's probably because Easter's coming. You know, that's where the hoppity is coming. Glenn. Well, because of you, I've been watching videos of baseball. So I'm going to talk to you now in a language that you would understand. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh, Enough said. Yeah, yeah. Oh, man. I have no idea what just happened. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, well, it, it, was, it was a little bit of Yogi Berra and a little bit of Curly Howard is the way it where I saw it. All right, so uh, I guess you guys head to the Skybox. We'll find out what all of that means in scores in just a moment. Put on your Mickey ears. Get ready for dreams to come true. Next Monday, we present an all-new Disney night. We're going to have special performances from surprise guests, along with a lot of Disney magic and more. It's a, another of our favorite theme nights. Next Monday at 8, 7 Central. Aaron. Hi. Hello. So just wanted to give you a little bit of news. Um, this is what I do in my other job, kind of give some updates. Um, I know tonight you are missing out in Chicago. They are raising the banner for uh, the Chicago Cubs, their home opener against the Los Angeles Dodgers. There's an update, though. There has been a rain delay, so they are going to wait to raise the banner. And what the Chicago Cubs did was they just played David and Lindsay's dance live at oh, Wrigley. Yeah. <laughs> so yes. the Cubs just called to let us know they had it on the scoreboard. Oh, that's and awesome. um, I just checked Twitter, and there's pictures of you all over and the dance. That's cool. And those are some tears. Just, well, it's just it's so much support from that group. And I was emotional before it started with the family. So I'm glad it's over. <laughs> a lot of emotion. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. It's a special group in Chicago, yeah. and those people are, have treated me with a ton of respect. I'm here, right? I'm here. I, yeah, cool. And Anthony Rizzo in that dance harness was life-changing. <laughs> All right, let's see what the judges thought. Carrie Ann Inaba. Seven. Len Goodman. Eight. Julianne Huff. Eight. Bruno Tognoli. Eight. 
for David and Lindsay. And since the game hasn't started, good news. All the fans can get to their phones and vote. You can, of Please. course, do it online or call. And I got a tweet last week about the Red Sox fans as well. So Boston fans, we you get it too. Yes. We'll take all we can good get. job, Tom. You. You. Absolutely. Chicago, that's how you do a rain delay. That's great. Rashad and Emma up next with a dedication to someone special in his life. Hear his story. See them dance when we come back. And then Erica, Simone, and Bonner will reveal their most memorable years live. NBA Playoffs starts Saturday on ESPN and ABC. Did Ben leave you here with Emma? Here, let me take her. Did you do that on purpose? Yes, and I feel really bad about it already. My hormones are all over the place today. I knew it was a bad idea the second I walked into that bar. Oh, Sam, why don't you bring a hat into the bar and see if Ben's still interested in you? Idiot! Whoa, why can't the TV show be more like this? This, I like. Oh my gosh, I totally dated that chipmunk. You mean my job driving multiple Grammy winner and talk show host Harry Connick Jr.? What? You shut your fat face! <laughs> I'm so sorry. It, it flew right out. Okay. You're okay. This is the original light beer, brewed with the belief that a beer could be light and not compromise on taste, to be enjoyed from first game to last call. Miller Light, hold true. It's about people. 